In from Tamil Nadu, where uh, Rajnikanth is ready to conduct another survey to s understand the political impact or the impact of uh, Kamal Hassan's political foray. So, are the friends doing each other a favor by trying to weigh each other's possibilities in politics? Let's ask Shabir, who's joining us with more on this story. Yes, Shabir. <coughs> Well, that's right, Anand. Sources have confirmed to Times now that Rajnikanth is carrying out yet another survey to try and assess the political impact of Kamal Hassan's entry into politics. Uh, already we have mentioned that it's going to be Kamal Hassan versus Rajnikanth. So he wants to be sure as to what will be the impact of Kamal Hassan, what is the kind of uh, uh, you know support that uh, he garners uh, from the people of Tamil Nadu. And as far as Kamal Hassan is concerned, he has already made it very clear that he is going to launch his own political party and he is going to go ahead with his own agenda. And this was confirmed to uh, Times Now in our interview uh, with Rahul Shivshankar where uh, Kamal Hassan clearly mentioned that he yes. had uh, had several rounds of meetings with uh, Rajnikanth himself and he has conveyed his decision that he is entering politics and uh, as a friend uh, uh, he wants to inform uh, personally uh, uh, you know, about his decision to Rajnikanth. So based on that uh, there seems to be yet another round of survey that's being carried out by Rajnikanth Khan's team to ensure that uh, what will be the impact of Kamal Hassan and what will be the impact of Rajnikanth after this announcement that has been made by Kamal Hassan entering Tamil Nadu politics. So clearly, uh, you know, Rajnikanth plan seems to have, uh, uh, you know, uh, hit some kind of, uh, uh, you know, one cannot say a roadblock, but uh, they seem it has been it has pushed uh, uh, Rajnikanth uh, uh, on a back foot. Uh, that is what uh, political analysts feel because.